for documentaries, Chimp Crazy is from the creators of Tiger King and follows the unusual people who are trying to keep chimps as pets. See it on Max now. On Peacock now, Face to Face with Scott Peterson revisits the sensational case where he was convicted of murdering his wife and her unborn child two decades ago. The Netflix sports documentary series Untold returns with the murder of Air McNair, about the murder of the former Titans quarterback. And Pop Star Academy follows producers trying to create the next big girl group. See it streaming now on Netflix. I want you guys to be aware you are equally as at fault for how this goes. As <laughs> For laps this week, comedian Matt Reif returns with a new special, now on Netflix. And finally, Are You Sure follows two members of the Korean supergroup BTS as they tour before heading to complete their mandatory military service. See a new episode on Disney Plus starting Thursday. Well, you can always get my movie reviews and home video pics sent right to your phones every week just by texting the word DEAN to 97999. Hope you have a great weekend in Chicago. I'm Dean Richards. What sticks out to y'all? Everything. Everything was pretty good. But what stuck out the most was the behind the scenes of people who own monkeys, chimps. And it's kind of the same thing as Tiger King because I was a big fan of Tiger King and mm. of everything that was going on. So many people had no idea, including myself, that that was going on behind closed doors. Mm. So I can't imagine with monkeys. That's true. Mm. That's true. Yeah. Mm. Pretty friends. Sounds very dangerous, though. Yeah, I know it does. Monkeys. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. yeah. Ugh. I mean, you know, tigers are too, but. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, more so. Um, I guess I'm interested a little bit in the B, B, BT, BTS uh, BTS mm -hmm. stuff. Um, I'm not really a, a fan. Sorry, but uh, Brianna was saying actually during the sh the what the segment that that what what did you say they have to they have to serve a certain amount of time yeah. in the military yeah. after a certain age for men. Okay. So that's what they they did. They got an extension because they were touring around touring. the world, but most of them decided to end the tour wow. and go serve their country. Okay, okay, yeah, that. So mm -hmm. I'm actually interested in that. That sounds really insane. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Like, it's a mixture of entertainment and duty to country. Yeah. That's, yeah. Whoa, like, that, that'd that be interesting to watch. Mm -hmm. And I was low-key wondering why I haven't heard from them. <laughs> yeah. I was like, where have they been? Are you a fan? Uh, <laughs> what does that mean? I was just wondering where they've been. Oh. Jeez, that's all. For no particular reason. No particular mm -hmm. reason. I was just like... <laughs> You know, where's BTS been? Yeah, so. they haven't mm -hmm. popped up on the top of your Spotify every Friday? Nope. Mm -mm. <laughs> well, they actually haven't because, you know, they've been... They've been gone. Been, oh. Been yeah. Serving their country. So. Mm -hmm. Yes. What about uh, you? Uh, <laughs> I guess I'm a big documentary guy, so I guess the murder of that football player, that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Oh, oh yeah. Since I'm I was, told. like, a child. I was like, oh, my gosh. Mm -hmm. So that mm -hmm. looked interesting to me. Oh, yeah, that's very history-related up, up your alley. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I think so. Yeah. Cool. Good for you. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. well, good morning. Thank you so much for joining us with NBC 23 News today. I'm Jeremiah Marshall. I'm meteorologist Brian Medina. And I'm your live cell host, Danielle Bonda. Guys, it's National Senior Citizen Day. Um, yeah, so today's your day to call any senior citizens in your family or friends or coworkers or whatever the case may be, um, or even strangers, and say, hello, how are you? How have you been? Do you need anything? Et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Mm -hmm. Spread good. kindness as yeah. much as possible. Oh, yeah. Today's your day. Yeah. I wonder if any, like, nursing homes or any, like, Rehabs are gonna do anything for their seniors today. That would be pretty Aww. cool. You know? Because, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, it's their day. Yeah. I know they have like senior day appreciation. We covered a story on that. Mm -hmm. Our uh, photographer, uh, Victor, covered a story on that. So I don't know. It'll be interesting to find out. Yeah. I'm sure they will. They always have like events mm -hmm, for, for them. them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to get them active, to get them. You know, socializing. Socializing, yes, that's a very good word. Yes. Yeah, yeah, and a lot of like local choirs on this day will go and sing at the nursing homes oh, and that's stuff true. like that. Yes. Yeah, I got to do that once, mm -hmm. and so I think it's really cool because um, you don't even have to get them a gift. You don't have to go, you know, do something extravagant. Just honestly, a conversation can go a long way. Yeah, yeah. and there's actually a lot of programs that do that. They'll ask for people to volunteer to go to nursing homes or senior citizen homes true. to just talk with yeah. with them and have a conversation or do arts and crafts with them because a lot of times they don't have any family left because they're a little bit older and mm -hmm. they need that companionship like everyone does from yeah. time to time. Yeah. And we're all going to get there. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, we are. Well, not me, but you guys. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
But I mean, senior citizens can you can watch uh, NBC 23 with them. Uh, they would enjoy that, right? Yeah. Yes, they would. <laughs> yeah. Wake up with us. <laughs> yeah. Watch us. Yeah. Let us interact with you. And yeah. speaking of which. Oh, yes. We have a few new viewer comments. They are excited that it's Wednesday. Actually, we had someone comment uh, happy Wednesday and put Wednesday Adams. Oh, that's funny. Yeah. Oh, and I really liked right. it because <laughs> we are just a little bit closer to, to October. Oh, yeah. That's Brianna's month. Yes. Yes. It's Halloween. Oh, yes, it is. Yes. I'm very, very excited. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then we have, okay, so the person who put that was El Mad Texan Cepeda. He put the Wednesday Adam gift. And then we have Robert Baron. He said, oh, I already said that one, but he said good morning. So good morning, Robert. Hey. And then we have Steven Gonzalez. He said, wishing you all a beautiful day. And then our friend Jaime Garcia said, hello, good morning. Have a great day. God bless you and with a cat and a coffee. Aww. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Oh, nice. Very, very nice. I yeah. feel like that uh, gif is for Brianna since she has a cat. Oh, yes, that is true. <laughs> and you like coffee. I do like coffee. That's true. Yeah. Somewhere it goes. Where, yeah. where are our gifs? Yeah. Gifs. I don't know what what do I like that this? will be in a gif? Huh. You had the pumpkin one or the pie one. The like peach pie. Peach pie. Oh, that's true. Because you were, yeah, that's right. That's right. Mm. Yeah, that is true. But it was very <laughs> thoughtful. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was. I don't know. And maybe get you some what? Sunshine? What, yellow something? What? Oh yeah. Some Honestly. viewers have put uh, sun sunrises. Orange juice, right? Orange juice. Thank tea. you. Tea. Tea. Yes. Yeah. That is right. Ah, thank you. Hmm. I just can't get behind drinking tea so early in the morning. Like I have really? to have coffee. Like <gasps> you drink tea I in do. the mornings. I drink in the hot mornings? tea. Mm -hmm. really? Yes, I do. He does. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you can even see a little tea bag coming out. Yeah, you know what? That is true. That's the only reason I know. I've never really seen you. Yeah. Yes, that is very, very Especially true. Especially when you have to like talk for so long. So like, oh, yeah, to do your throat. Too much. To prep it yeah. before. Mm -hmm. That's so true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We do talk a lot here at work. We do. Yeah. If you didn't think so, now you know. I know. Yeah. We talk a lot here. Uh, We're professional yappers. Mm. That's yeah. so true. <laughs> our, our viewers told us. Yeah. You guys told, and then Brianna told us what you said. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> In school, I always got in trouble for like talking too much in class, and now I made it into a professional. Wow! So, Look at you now. Here we are. I know. <laughs> it fits perfectly. It does. It does. I was the opposite. I was very quiet <gasps> and very shy. What? Yeah. I can't imagine. You're so like bubbly and. Uh, I know. Yeah, I was very shy, very quiet in school, and I would let people kind of walk all, all over me until I was like, I've had enough. Yeah. No more. And now I just Bust talk. Up. Yeah, I talk all voice. the time. I stand up for myself. I'm very opinionated. Yeah. You found your voice. I did. And you I did. use it to tell the weather. Yes, I do. Mm. Yes, That's I awesome. Do. Yeah. I'm using it for a good cause. Oh, I would think so. Yeah, we all do. I mean, Honestly. that's why we're in our professions. <laughs> yeah. But, I mean, conditions are going to be hot. I am a little tired of <laughs> saying that time and time again, but this is just that time of year here in the Rio Grande Valley, but conditions are going to be a little hotter today than yesterday, and we've been talking about this for several days already, and that's because we're in the influence of a mid to upper level ridge of high pressure that is literally in the panhandle of Texas, which Right now, conditions are not that bad. We are waking up with feels like temperatures in the upper 70s to 80s. So right around the actual temperatures. So it's not unbearable this morning. So if you have to walk your dog, if you have to get a good exercise,